water, down through the water, and also down through the sand and mud and other sediments on the river bottom, all the way down to bedrock. And those were the deepest bridge spear foundations built up to that time. Now, James Eads, the designer, builder, and namesake of the bridge, was also known for several other accomplishments during his lifetime. For example, during the U.S. Civil War, he designed and built a series of iron armored gunboats, which were used by the North on the Mississippi River and tributary rivers during the U.S. Civil War. As we pass underneath these bridge, we are rapidly approaching a second bridge. This is the Dr. Martin Luther King Bridge, originally named the East St. Louis Veterans Bridge. It was built by the city of East St. Louis, which is located over on the Illinois shore to our right. This bridge opened for traffic in 1951, and it was the first road-only bridge to cross the river here in the downtown St. Louis area. Now, there were older bridges that had road decks on them, but they also had railroad tracks on them. This was the first road-only bridge to cross the river here in the downtown area. Now, the Dr. Martin Luther King Bridge is not really tied in with uh, the interstate highway system or anything like that. It primarily today serves as local traffic relief between the two sides of the river. Uh, at one time, however, Route 66 uh, did cross the Mississippi River here at St. Louis on the Dr. Martin Luther King Bridge. Although at different times during its existence, Route 66 also crossed the river here on a couple of other bridges in the area. Uh, Route 66 was rerouted through the St. Louis area several times during its existence. In just a minute, a few moments, we're going to be passing three big round rusty things sticking up out of the water over on our left side. And you might notice that abandoned looking pavilion thingy over there on the left shore. Up until about 2011, there was a large floating casino boat in the water there between that pavilion and the three mooring cells, as these round rusty things are called. That was the Admiral Casino. The SS Admiral was a very large excursion boat, several times bigger than the Tom Sawyer. Uh, that was built here in 